you notice the lake though today? It was rough. Very out. choppy. Yeah. No yeah. swimming for you, I no, bet. No, no, no. Why? The alert came in last night at about yeah. nine o'clock, so mm -hmm. I was no no swimming today. Yeah, after today though, a lot better if you want to get out to not just the beaches, but get a swim in out on the lake. The winds though, they're perpendicular to the lake shore, and as you look live at North Avenue Beach, we're still dealing with wave heights around four feet here in Cook County, but between now and 1 a.m. could be anywhere between three and seven foot waves. So dangerous swimming conditions through the evening gets better though for tomorrow. So does the uh, temperatures. You're right, Erica. It's going to feel a lot, a lot more like beach weather starting midweek. 70s tomorrow will be near 90 though Wednesday and Thursday. Thursday, a weather alert posted for the chance of strong to severe thunderstorms, especially as we head into the afternoon and evening. Some cooler air behind that front that comes in on Thursday to wrap up the work week. And then the heat comes back in a big way just in time for Father's Day. Sunday, we're back in the 90s. A week from today, we could be in the mid 90s near record territory. So we'll enjoy, I guess, the cool air mass while we have it. 61 in Gary, 57 in Michigan City. So we have that wind coming off the lake as you move inland. It gets a little bit milder in the low 70s, 73 in Ottawa tonight under a mostly clear sky and lighter winds. Temperatures will fall into the 40s outside of Chicago. As cold as 41 tonight in Rensselaer, 45 in Valparaiso, anywhere between 50 and 52 degrees across Chicago. So some sunshine tomorrow, a chilly start at least for this time of the year tomorrow. And then we're in the 70s and milder than today for tomorrow afternoon with increased cloud cover. Temperatures tomorrow coolest near the lake shore, low to mid 70s away from the lake near 80 degrees, especially in the southwest suburbs. We're going to go 89, slight chance of thunderstorm in the afternoon on Wednesday, and then a 60% chance of showers and thunderstorms on Thursday. Look at the high temperature on Thursday at 91. Thursday would be the hottest temperature so far here in Chicago, and we have already had our area highlighted by the Storm Prediction Center for the threat of severe weather in the afternoon and evening time on your Thursday. At this point, we think a front will interact with that hot air mass and highs in the 90s and allow for the chance of severe weather producing damaging winds and also some large hail. Exact timeline on that still needs to be worked out, so tune in tonight at 10. We'll have a new round of models, but we have a weather alert posted either way for Thursday for the risk of severe weather. That's a cold front behind that front. Cooler air at 79, 80 degrees, but cooler near the lake on Saturday. Saturday looks like a nice day, and then we get into the heat for Father's Day on Sunday at 92 with an isolated thunderstorm chance. A week from today, another day we'll have to watch for the potential of strong to even severe thunderstorms because that would be the hottest temperature so far this summer at 90. Well, it's not summer yet, but it feels like right 95 degrees and a storm chance at 30 percent. So a lot of ups and downs in that forecast Thursday, though. That's the day to watch in the days ahead. Hey, if it looks and feels like summer, might as well call it exactly. <laughs> Thank agree. you, Albert. Northwestern's basketball team gets some bragging rights over the Illini in the offseason. Plus, the young Chicago Sky team has hit some growing pains in the season. What they need to do to break out of their slump. Coming up tonight at 10, a storage unit nightmare. We meet up with an up-and-coming designer who says a thief ruined his dreams.